Copy. Shoot through my. Yeah, three times. We have shots fired. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. We're going to be using a vehicle pack by High Gear Studios. And there's a Crown Vic right there. And then we're going to be using the Chevy Tahoe back over here. It comes with about seven vehicles. I really love the color, the brown and the white. It's something a little bit different. And then I'm using a emergency uniform pack that you can get off the AlicePDFar.com site as well. I really love the raincoat here. It's turned out super cool. And let's go ahead and get started on the patrol here, guys. I really appreciate all the likes here lately on the videos. You guys are awesome. Let's get started. We're going to get out of here on Palato Boulevard. Attention all units. Citizens reporting a suspicious vehicle on a Great Ocean Highway. Units respond code 2. Good hey John. I'll take that. Okay, we've got a suspicious vehicle reported for some dangerous driving. We'll give this a uh, try here. I think he may be just coming up on our left here. Yeah, that's him. I think he's in a sports car. He's right there trying to drive slow next to me. Look at him. He's right there. Passing me. Yeah. You ever done that? Like being on the highway and then you see a police officer? I think we all have done that. All of, all of you that drive, you uh, start to drive real slow when you see an officer. I know I did all the time. You automatically feel guilty like it's you that he was looking at the whole time. I do it all the time. Okay, we're gonna come up on him um, on the from behind here. Okay, that just did not sound right. <laughs> we're gonna follow him a little bit. Sorry, Benzo's mind's in the gutter today. Oh, look at him going really slow. Maybe that's what it is. Maybe it's uh, not dangerous driving as in fast. Look how slow he's going, guys. Look at this. Yeah, that's the problem. He's probably committing like road rage with this RV right here. Let's sneak in right real fast. Look how slow he's going. That's what it is. He's being a little a-hill out here. All right, let's light him up. Don't you run from me. I'm the sheriff of the law. Okay, does he not want to pull over? There he goes. Yeah, he's being a little, kind of a rich little a-hill here. That's what he is. Three, John. Show me out here. We'll get a. We'll be out here in a traffic stop, northbound US Route One. You get a twenty-eight. It's going to be in a Banshee, black in color. Occupied one time. Seven eight. Tom William Victor seven eight eight. Target license plate. Seven eight. Tom William Victor seven eight eight. No ten ninety nine. Okay, registered to a Tom West. And uh, let's go ahead and get a backup out here just in case. Now normally I wouldn't do this, but. Just in case. I don't like how they come code three, but you know. The reason why it does that is because the ELS. But they'll come over here. Let's see. Here they come. I guess they'll get it before long. Here they come. I'm going to go ahead and get out and approach the vehicle. I don't really need to code 5 this yet. Oh, let's start. oh yeah, I guess we are going to code 5 it. There he goes. Let's go. Okay, three John, we're going code 3. We're going northbound. You just route 1. What's he going to do? Stop? Oh, really? Get out of there. Get out. Get out. Hands up. Hey, it's not that serious. Hey, it is that serious. Hipster. Get out. Okay, he's running. He's not going to stop either. Oops, let's go ahead and do this. Oh, well, that's funny. I'm like trying to talk on the radio and run at the same time. Let's see if this officer could beat me. Hey, I was in track in high school, buddy. You're not going to beat me. <laughs> okay, three John, we're heading uh, southbound Palito Boulevard. Foot pursuit. 
Stop right there. Stop. Okay. So, John, we are indeed code four. We got one at gunpoint. 15 times one. Alright, man. What's your deal? What are you doing out here on US Route 1? Dropping real slow. Committing road rage, is that what you're doing? Here, come with me. Let's get back over here. Okay, we'll probably pat him down right here. We may even get a pickup and then we'll get back on patrol, depending on what's going on with this guy. Let's take a look at this guy. Okay, let's let's pat him down real fast. I thought my uh, backup would just stay here with me. That did not happen. Alright, what does he got? Police stick? Where'd you get that, man? Alright. Backup needed in uh, Palato Bay. He's got a concealed uh, handgun license on him as well, but he doesn't have a weapon or anything. To transport you don't. Okay, they're gonna pick him up and we're gonna go. Alright. Let's get back to our vehicle. I'm gonna search his vehicle real fast. Several cans of spray paint. Prosthetic car. Okay. Get a 50 in my location, please. Assistance required on Great Ocean Highway. Get him picked up. Okay, we just got a call that we have another vehicle that's uh, driving a little bit more suspicious. I'm not sure what's going on with the actual vehicles driving real slow but we're gonna follow in conjunction with this uh, looks like we've got two other officers that's in the front you can see they're following this vehicle here so we're gonna come up behind them here I don't know if that's another police vehicle right here or not it may be no it's not okay let me get up here they asked me to take primary so sneak in here a little bit We'll light him up. We got a lot of backup here, so we'll gonna park right here. All right, here we go. I'm gonna get up here and approach them. Hopefully, he won't run off from him. He's probably gonna run off, but let's see. Hello, sir. Deputy Benzo, Blaine County Sheriff. See your ID, please. Okay, this is Ken Rosenberg. Ken, why are you driving out here in the forest? We got reports that uh, you're driving very suspiciously out here. I think we had just. Uh, let's see, what, what should we do? Anything that vehicles shouldn't be? He says, nope. Nothing to drink or anything like that, right? He says, breathalyze me then. He's all bad. All right, can I search your vehicle? I know this is highly legal, but hey. It says, you cops always take away my rights. Tell you what, sir, why don't you go ahead and step out of the vehicle, please. Here, come with me. Here, turn around, please. Thank you. We'll get it back over here. All right. Fucking crazy. Hey, settle down. Yeah, he's got some regular breathing. Maybe just, uh, it may be inebriated. That's what it is. I think that's what it is because it's already asking me to breathalyzing. All right, turn around, please. It's for your protection, my protection. Just want to make sure you don't have anything legal on you. Nothing's going to poke me, stick me, harm me anyway. Okay, and then, oh, he's got some PCP on him, fentanyl. Yeah. All right, sir, do me a favor. Go ahead and turn, turn around, put your hands behind your back. You're currently being arrested for possession of illegal substances. Narcotics and also prescription drugs. And then I, I am just curious. Uh, turn around, sir. I want to breathalyze you since you asked me to breathalyze you. <laughs> breathalyze me, Dan. Okay, we will. 
Let's see what does he got on him here in the system. Oh, that's alcohol. I'm sorry. Alcohol 0.164%. Yeah, he's intoxicated. That's why he's driving the way he is. And let's go ahead and uh, just for grins, let's do a drug elizer on him. Now, this you wouldn't be able to drug elize all these, all these substances in the field. A few of them, yes. He's got PCP and fentanyl on him, but he's negative for everything. Maybe he just sells it, right? What do you think down below, guys? Let me know. All right, we're going to go ahead and get a transport. All right. I love how they just stayed in their vehicle, too. You want a ticket? Dumb fuck. <laughs> they just want to insult him and take him. All right, let's go ahead and search his vehicle, because I'm just curious if he's got anything else on him. What did you call me? <laughs> what is the deal with them having uh, nightsticks lately? We'll get him towed away. Uh, let's see. We'll just do it this way. Get a 51. All right. It's going to get him in that vehicle over there. And we're going to get back on patrol. John 21, we have a traffic alert for possible terrorist activity. Ooh. You John, copy that. Okay, we got a vehicle that is coming our way. And I'm just going to stay right here because he's going to come our way anyway. He's wanted in connection to some type of terrorist attack or something like that. Links to ISIS is what it says. Now watch this, this video get demonetized. Attention Unit 3, John 21, approach with caution. I don't know if he sees me over here or not. It's that vehicle right there, that Washington. Black in color. We'll go ahead and find, get him over here and we'll get him pulled over. Three John, stand by, please. 10 4, copy that. I'm not going to wait. I'm just going to pull him over. Get in some backup. We'll get we'll code five this since he's wanted in connection. All right, three John, go ahead and roll me some code three backup, please. Oh, here they come. Oh shit, here they come. Oh shit, get back. I can't get to my weapon, guys. I'll shoot through my. Okay, three John. We have shots fired. One for good measure. Three John, code four. What is going on behind me here? What happened? Did something go down there? What is going on down here, guys? I think uh, just a vehicle just exploded. Holy crap, man. She almost killed me, man. Yeah. All right, 3 John, go ahead and roll some uh, EMS, please. Even though there's no way that that vehicle, I mean, that lady's going to survive. Oh my gosh, man. I was kind of panicking a little bit, to be honest, because uh, she was shooting me. I think a lot of officers probably do that. They shoot through their own vehicle, probably. <laughs> I didn't have a good line of sight. Can y'all get to her? I don't think I can even get to her, am I? Oh, he's going to give me a... Alright, thank you, sir. Appreciate that. Here, can you not get to her? Let me see if I can drag her out. I'm here. It's gonna be okay. Okay, they're gonna do CPR on her. I was about to say, maybe I could drag her out of there. There's no way they're gonna get her up. Shot her right in the face. <laughs> I 
Yeah, CPR failed. It does suck. They almost killed me. Alright, I'm gonna drag her out. Plus, I'll, I love to drag bodies. Hey, get out of here. Yeah, I'm gonna drag her out of there. <laughs> here we go. I'll get her up. Well, I drag her anyway. <laughs> We'll drag her out here. Yeah, about right here. It's good. <laughs> okay, we'll probably get in the corner as well. She's going to bleed all over the place here. Yeah, let's just get a corner. There we go. Okay, corner unit is coming. Yeah, let's go through her, her vehicle, too, because uh, she had a lot of just, I mean, I think she's involved with terrorist activity or something like that. Search her vehicle. Samurai sword, clown mask. Well, I mean, clown outfit. She is involved with terrorist activity, so. All right, guys, perfect opportunity for a benzo timestamp. Guys, uh, look at the video time. Go down and post that in the video time. Greatly appreciate that. And do hashtag Benzo Effect. Thank you guys so much. Especially all the newcomers that are coming to the channel. You guys are awesome. Thank you for checking me out. I release videos pretty much every single day. There might be a day that goes by every once in a while. It's not like that. Alright, I think the corners are here. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and shut down traffic now. I'm going to stop all traffic. That kind of keeps them from honking so much. Okay, they're going to take pictures of her. Right, I need to get uh, body bags reinstalled. That's where they look like they're on a stretcher. It's kind of cool, right? Get her towed away. It'll be a large flatbed this time. And clear traffic. This should all clear up here. Um, actually, you know what? This truck, I think, is probably abandoned because uh, all the gunfire. Okay, guys, we're going to go ahead and end our episode right here. Thank you guys so much for watching today's episode. You guys are awesome. Thank you guys to the Patreons and the members of the Benzo Effect channel. You guys are freaking awesome. Thank you for hitting that subscribe button to the newcomers. And thank you for hitting the like button. We'll see you tomorrow, guys. Later.